Hello everybody, this is Kathy and welcome to Stretch the Sketch. This is the photograph that I'll be using and um, and I'm using Paige Evans a um, couple sheets of uh, just some scraps of paper. Stretch a Sketch is where you take the sketch that we're using and we stretch it to a double page layout or you shrink it down. Now, I have been working in my 6x8 album. And I'm almost done with it. But I think I can squeeze a couple more pages in. Now, first thing I'll be doing is I'm going to make that, uh, that line around my paper. Now, it says to do journaling there. But... I thought it would be cute if I used a stamp and just stamped it. Now I do end up cutting my purple paper down and um, because I didn't make the square big enough so I am trimming that down in a little bit. Now I will have links to everybody that is participating in the description box below so please go check out their channels and see how they are what they are doing with the sketch now earlier i showed you where i the things that i will be using on my layout um, some of the ephemera pieces that i use is from jen hatfield and then the paper i just pulled out some scraps from paige evans all right, so then I realized that my paper was a little bit too big, so I just trim it down just a little bit. And now I start layering the papers. Now I am using a vellum sheet, and I think that is from Paige Evans too. I've been really getting into the vellum paper behind my photo. I think it, it just adds extra um, something to my photo. All right, so now it's time to build. Now up in the sketch, it has like scallops. So I went ahead and used a border punch to make, make the little scallops. And I do end up covering each end with ephemera so I'm gluing those down and that's just about I didn't put a title on this page I um, one of the ephemera on there says um, no I don't have it with me or right here but I know the house that I use says family time so now let me tell you about my photo. Every year our small town has Ag Day where they all the farmers bring their cows, their pigs, their horses, um, bunnies, goats, um, you know, just all kinds of um, farm animals and they bring their tractors too. Now, when my kids were younger, back in the 80s, they, um, I would go up town and my daughters had their friends get inside that scoop and get a picture. So they wanted to do their kids and recreate the, you know, their photo. So that's what the grandkids are doing. They're, now you can see Lily on the right hand side. She is so sassy. She loves taking silly pictures. <laughs> so, but yeah, I'm finally documenting this and I will write on that brown, that craft tag, um, what year it was. And I think it was 2018 or maybe it was last year before all of this um, 
COVID-19 started. So, I, um, I thought this one was cutie sitting there holding flowers and, um, so I'm going to glue that piece on there. I can't think of what they're called, but um, I thought he was really cute. And then I'm adding some foam adhesive to the house. And it says family time. So that that is about it. I do come in and add a couple enamel dots. But other than that, um, that's about it. I do have some close-ups coming up, and I, um, yeah, it, it was a fun layout to do. Um, I hope you all enjoyed it, and please go check out the other girls. I will have their links listed below, and thank you so much for coming. Y'all have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.